What is going on, Draconians? Draco Invictus here with episode 18 of our revisited series of Night of the Dead, and I am getting in my morning fishing. It's currently hour six. I already had a few visitors at about 4 a.m. come knocking on the door, and they were just incredibly rude. I think they were drunk. But anyway, uh, we're doing a spot of early morning fishing and i am going to uh we're going to continue working on the front i'm also going to look at putting in some of the the machines like the mining machine and stuff like that because i've never used any of that stuff before so i want to uh take a look and see what that's going to do and uh so yeah we're gonna just knock out some fish in here real quick and we will get to work so let's get to it All right, guys, so uh, the here is your official. Oh, that's the wrong one. There we go. Here is your official fishing report for the pond behind the old police station. The catches of the day are goldfish at three, AU at two, Hiroku at two, Zacco platypus at five. The big catch of the day is the beta at six, salmon at two, angelfish at five. Arowana at two and Koi at one. Now we did catch one clay and we let one go just so that we can keep the clay flowing in the pond behind the old police station. That's going to wrap it up for your fishing report for the day here in Night of the Dead. All right, guys. So we're going to, um, I went and grabbed a bunch of stuff that I've had in storage because I, I knew I was going to need fuses. So I made a bunch of batteries, yada, yada, yada. Uh, got a couple motors, uh, got a couple engines. So we're going to put down some of this stuff and just see how it does. I, I, I don't know what it takes. Probably, probably takes fuel, doesn't it? That's going to be my, my guess here. All right cool yeah fuel and a maintenance kit okay so we need to make maintenance kits let's go do that really quickly see what that's gonna entail maintenance kits there they are all right so let's make uh three. Oh, i can't make three just oh i need more leaves Yes, I always need leaves for my maintenance kit. That makes perfect sense. All right, got those done. I'm hoping that everything else requires the same sort of thing. Got a boar. I'm waiting on a pig. Ultimately, I'm going to have to go hunting because I need some more bear to get the rest of our stuff upgraded. Okay. It's a shame we can't hook these up to electricity, huh? That would be awesome. All right, so that is a quarrying machine, and now we're going to do a mining machine. I suppose we could put it over here so that we could do multiples of them, right? That's the idea. Oh, I see you sitting there. Look at her. Being all quiet. She's being coy. Okay. Oh, this one takes two maintenance kits. All right, let's go kill her really quick. She's just standing there doing nothing until I looked over the wall. All right, um, let's go ahead and build the, um, the, oh, I, what am I missing now? More iron ingot. Okay, so we need some more iron ingot and we'll make a, several of the maintenance kits. Luckily, the maintenance kits are all pretty inexpensive stuff here. So let's make like, I don't know. Well, I guess four. Oh, because we need more leaves. More leaves. I have lots of leaves. I'm going to leave them alone. <laughs> oh, there we go. Okay. And uh, then we just need iron ingots. Come on. 
And I don't have any up here. So let's make some of those. Well. Oh, I don't know. I was like, what? Why isn't that showing up? Uh-oh. I'm almost out of branches. <gasps> God, what am I going to do? Go cut down some trees, I suppose. All right. That should be... Oh, now I need rubber rings as well. Okay. Well, those I got a crap ton of. All right. Now we have everything that we need. And hopefully we have enough maintenance kits for all this stuff. So that one's running. And then, oh, there's a big boy here. A big old chonky boy. Let's put it like right here. Nice. Cool. Two, okay. So we need five maintenance kits, what, per day, I suppose? Is that what it is? Inventory full. What? Oh, because I grabbed everything that I've made for electronics. That's why. Um, do I have one of something to eat? No. I'm not going to eat the, the red mushrooms. All right. We'll come back for you, little mushroom dude. I don't know how efficient these are going to be. We'll see. This is my box for all my electronic stuff. So all of this, I made a bunch of uh, trap machines. Knowing that we were going to be needing a bunch of them today. Um, yeah, we'll put the maintenance kits in there for now. All right, I think. Oh, it's also the stacks of freaking iron ore. Jesus. All right, I gotta go grab that mushroom. I can't let mushrooms go to waste. Friends don't let friends let mushrooms go to waste. All right, that's how it goes. There you are. Yeah, getting into some of the bigger recipes, I don't need the rock. Uh, mushrooms are what I'm short on because I typically don't stop and pick them up. So, I'm just going to have to keep that in mind going forward. Alright. So. Well, before we get going on... The stuff out front. I think I'm going to take a little bit of time and go cut down some trees and some shrubs and uh, so that we can get some more branches. That's crazy that I'm out of branches, but it is what it is. So I'm going to dump all the crap that I picked up thinking that I was going to be working out front and uh, I'm going to go get some branches. So I'll be right back. All right, guys. So I did a little bit of clearing. The fact is, is you can actually see the high school from here now. And uh, yeah, I didn't think it was, I knew it was close, but damn it, you can actually see it. So um, yeah, we got, uh, we got a bunch, I mean, look at that, 356 branches. So got us a lot of branches. Uh, I'm still not worried about our traps right now. I still have plenty of everything, uh, but these stopped running. So is it twice a day? God, it's got to be more than twice a day because I wasn't 5 a.m. when I put these down. So, I mean, we, we've got pieces of iron. We've got stuff. Um, I need more maintenance kits, apparently. Yeah, all right. Hmm. I don't know. Is that... Is, are these worth it i don't know i guess we'll grab the other maintenance kits because this one was one right and then the other two are two yeah okay 
Yeah, I don't know if these are very cost effective. I mean, I guess versus time, because I don't have to go out and gather all that stuff. But, but sweet lord. Okay, come on. There we go. Uh, maintenance kits. There we go. Five. So let's get these rolling again. <laughs> Damn game saves. They're getting longer. I think they do that on purpose so that we don't continue to play the game. Alright. I'm not going to build any more of those right now. Simply because I don't know if they're too terribly effective. We'll see. Our farms are coming along. I put down some more farm plots. Some of them, like these are upgraded to tier two. These two are upgraded to tier three. I don't think we get anything different. I think we just get more of them. I think that's what the, the trick is with those. So, all right. And I picked up a bunch of mushrooms and obviously berries and stuff like that. So I'm going to get all this put away and then we're going to head out front and see what we can do. All right, guys. <clears throat> so... Uh, here we are. I got all the floors and stuff upgraded, but, um, for the most part, <laughs> there's a few concrete things, no wooden things. Obviously we had that done uh, the day before. So, um, just for reference, yes, you can fit too wide. I hate how this zooms in sometimes. So, yes, you can do it. Come on, autosave. Sweet lord. But I'm not going to do it here. Again, I'm not trying to bottleneck them. I don't want them slowing down like we've been seeing them do over here. Oh, yeah. Um, I got a couple flamethrowers installed. Oh, that was cool. Um, we don't want them bottlenecking like they were under that compressor the other night. So I'm going to just do things. Um, the cutters just seem so slow now. But things to damage them, slow them down. We have the headroom here, so even if we wanted to put in like a pendulum or something like that, uh, we could do it. If I could get it to freaking go away from me. Why won't, why am I building in the middle? Why, 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 why? I don't know. Because it won't let me put it down. Because I'm standing in the middle of the... This is so stupid. Because I'm standing in the middle of the trap, it won't let me set it down. It's the weirdest thing. I wonder if it'll let me do it out here. Is it a constraint thing? Nope. I don't know what the hell happened. How did I get zoomed in on the, the build process? Why am I standing in the middle of this trap? That doesn't even make any sense. I mean, that... Come on. There's a problem there. Anyway, as I was saying, we have the headroom. Come on. That's the wrong way, but still. We have the headroom to do it. Certainly. And that might be fun too, you know, a pendulum. So it knocks them back, back into the flamer again. That's, oh yeah, I actually like that idea. Um, and then we'll just do um, shredders and cutters and stuff like that in here. Now, 
Now, why won't there... And I probably did not bring anything with me, yeah, to upgrade, so. We won't be doing that tonight. That's all right. So then I went and put another compressor right here. And the reason I don't have the floor spikes here is simply because uh, this is the path for them to get out if they fall through the trap doors later on. I don't want to impede them by putting something that is going to lower, lower the ceiling height underneath. So that's why there's no uh, spiky traps here. Eventually, I'll probably put like a wall or something here to block this off because we can load them from here. So that's not a big deal. Make sure that they're loaded before the, the wave starts and we're good to go. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and just finish putting the, the shredders seem to be the ones that are really kind of working, working. It. Oh, 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 can I, can I, oh, oh, I can. Ooh, ooh, that one was tight, huh? Right there at the stairs. Nice. So this is certainly going to soften up the heavies and then they'll get finished off in here so i think that's where we're going to leave it for today i wasn't i didn't get to my project out here that'll be for probably tomorrow's episode so um yeah i i brought a bunch of stuff that i didn't really need but i didn't bring a bunch of stuff that i really did need but i didn't run back up let me make sure oh it was the stairs over here these stairs can i upgrade these stairs i have to repair them Oh, look at that. One out of one rebar. Nice. And these are already all done. Um, all right. Do I have anything to put down any? Plenty. Nice. I say plenty. Things to soften up. Not zombies. Infected. Get it right. It's like a landfill, a landmine field out here. It's just, and, and honestly, now that I've moved, well, I only moved it a little bit. So they should still try and run that corner. Now I did notice in here, I need some spikes. Just more things for me to run into really. And then the same thing over here, because when they come from that direction, it's just a long shot for them to just kind of run without taking any damage and I just can't handle that. And then uh, we'll end up watching where they come from tonight, how they maneuver. And I may end up filling in some here around the cars. This is good. This is again, just to slow them down a little bit, just to damage them a little bit. And then we'll make sure that we have enough over here just in case. Yeah, see, we're a little lacking over here. They're cheap to put down, for sure. I have so much cloth to make more rope. Oh my god. Okay, so um, that looks like gonna work now of course if we if we get friends from this side tonight then they'll have a free way until they get to here and tomorrow uh we will get all of these hooked up uh upgraded and yeah hopefully finish the next phase of our awesome awesome well hold on a second here
Let me see. Um, I I got some nails. We can certainly uh, do this. Slow them down right in front of the. Uh, can I put it right here? No. Oh, it's because the stairs are there. I get it. There we go. And uh, that would be a shame. That would be nice to put some there too. Oh well. Uh, what else can we throw at him tonight? What else we got? I thought about using this little uh, meat mallet thing in the middle, right at the top of the stairs, to kind of push, force them one way or another. But I thought the compressor would actually do a better job. We also have some guillotines that we could... Um, it looks like we could put one in. Because I am about to run out of iron ingots. Where do we want to put a guillotine? Maybe right at the top of the stairs, right in front of the compressor, like right, right here. I like that we can put it inside. Oh, I guess it's not quite inside. So that's in front. Let's go ahead and put it right there. Oh yeah, that'll be lovely. All right, cool. I'm going to go clean out my inventory and get ready for the wave. And the flamethrowers are all hooked up uh, to power. They are powered. Oh, shut that door. And that door we can leave open. Um, They're powered to the spike launchers up here. So they will only be targeting heavies and giants. Speaking of giants, it's a giant kind of night, isn't it? All right. I will catch you guys when the wave starts. All right, guys, it is time for wave 18. Bring on the giants. I also went down and I put a light on the back of the, um, the sign up there. So maybe we can see them dropping in a little bit better. Because that sign's right above that truck where I think they're dropping in. So hopefully we'll be able to see that tonight. Um, mortars aren't turned on yet. Uh, we will wait until we have uh, confirmation of the giants before we go flipping that switch. This is the point in the video that I say, hey, if you're liking this content, smash the crap out of, of oh, giants already. Smash the crap out of that like button and uh, let YouTube know that you want to see more content like this. You can also subscribe, click the bell notification icon, select all from the drop down menu, and uh, you will definitely be getting some notifications about when I post a new video or go for a live stream or something like that. And uh, if you really want to help out, watch the videos. Don't cut them short. Uh, view time is vitally important for the algorithm to let YouTube know that this is content that you're interested in and that other people should be interested in as well. They sure are taking a while to get over here. Anyway, uh, <laughs> if you want to help in a more uh, financial way, there are ways to do that down in the description below, or you can simply click on the join button, become a member today, get access to all the emotes, all of the badges, all of that cool stuff, all in one place. So give it a thought. And until then, uh, let's uh, enjoy the horde. See, there's way too much gathering down there, and that bothers me.
crap <laughs> wow that was insane wow that was crazy and no chip there let's 
Let's see. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe. Yep, there we go. Got us a chip with that one. All right, so we had two of them, and damn it, he was so interested in the light that I put way up at the top of that pole that he was never going to get to. That was the biggest problem. So, unfortunately, maybe I'm going to have to take those lights down. I'm going to have to build freaking stairs to get up there because they're way too high. Anyway, um, I don't like the bottlenecking that's happening. Because it just makes them go crazy and start beating on crap. But then again, I mean, nothing here is, I mean, 91%. Yeah, I kind of figured all my traps were all going to be triggered and all that good stuff, but... So yeah, um, interesting. Take, there we go. So let me know what you think down in the description below. Again, the little project that I'm working on here uh, should help with this issue. We'll have to see how it goes. But that is for another episode. Man, it is already hour four. I better drop a save here. Otherwise, I'm going to be cutting into fishing time. Let's see, day 18, hour four. Oof, man. All right. <laughs> yeah, that's a great screenshot there. A giant coming at you. Uh, that is going to wrap it up for this one. If you have any questions, comments, kicks, or complaints, go ahead and leave them down in the comment section below. If you got nothing to say, hey, drop me an emoji, a big thumbs up in the comment section. And uh, at least it helps with the algorithm. I appreciate it. And until next time, you take care of yourselves out there. This is Draco Invictus saying this has been the best day of my life. See you.